the one from off the rail flash paper owned and trained by John Perrin of Lebanon Donovan Jr. drives number two Wild Rain owned by Lionel Weicker of Zanesville Randy Tharps the trainer driver three Creole owned by Doug Ream of Columbus and uh, Trafford Ream of uh, Monsterling Kevin Earhart is the uh, trainer for Dave Miller the four Sonny Sally owned and trained by Ira Kreutzer West Alexandria handled by Brent Holland the five Halcyons Prelude, owned and trained by Rex Boda, Thornville for Dell Miller. Number six, Honey Bun Osborne, owned by Gene Hall and uh, Gary Conley, both of Kentucky. Herbie Brown trains and drives. The seven, Price of Fame, owned by Jalen Morris of Dashler. Richard Morris trains. Jim Shelton drives. Number eight, No Sale. Little Marshall Wagner of Fredericktown, Ohio, Eric Call trains for Tom Hall. The nine, Casey's Noble Dow, owned and trained by Paul Garns of Grove City, Eric Ledford in the bike. And the ten, Ed Denise, owned by Ralph Sexton and Francis Thomas of Hamilton, Ralph Sexton trains Brad Hanners in the Sonky. Win place show, trifecta, twin trifecta wagering, eight minutes. Seventh race, condition pacing, Phillies and Mares are all in behind the gate. On the back stretch, there they go. And uh, they're off, and it's Sunny Sully. First for the lead, Wild Rain to the inside, getting away. Second, Creel from between these two is third. At the far outside, no sail, keep away fourth. Off the pylons, five, it's Flash Paper. Slipping through sixth, uh, Denise along the rail and racing is seventh at Celsius Prelude. At the relay, Tony Van Osborne followed by Price of Fame. The early trailer, Casey's Noble Dell around the first turn. And that's Wild Rain. Odds on favorite with the lead here, a length and a half, too. Sonny Sally at the guard spot is racing a second. No sale, parked to the outside. Third opening panel, 27 and 4. Inside, racing fourth, Creole. Then it's a gap of two lengths. Five to Flash Paper. Another two lengths to Ed Denise. Moving uh, seventh comes Halcyon's Prelude at the rail and eighth. Honey Bun Osborne and underway now comes Price of Fame. That leaves the trailer Casey's Noble Dow. Approaching the half and it's Wild Rain in complete control here as they reach the half in 58 and 2. A nice breather here for Wild Rain as she takes into the back stretch. Sunny Sally has yet to move on the inside. Still parked, no sail, and now three wide comes Flash Paper Creole slipping up the rail here fourth. Out of the outside comes Halcyon's Prelude using live cover as they fire down the back stretch. And on the front, Wild Rain now extends the lead by two, two and a half. Flash paper to the outside as they're pressuring that leader. Sonny Sally still along the rail is still waiting third. Creel at the rail is fourth. Three quarters, 127 and three as they round the final turn and it's Wild Rain. Still leading here. She's had it her way the entire mile. She still leads by two, a comfortable lead here. Sonny Sally is second. Now less than an eighth of a mile to go and down the stretch they come. Wild Rain extends that lead. Now three, now four, five lengths. Wild Rain is drawing clear here. The battle begins now for place. It's Wild Rain at the wire. Creole getting up for second. Sunny Sally third. Here's the winner number two, Wild Rain, six-year-old daughter of call for Rain. From the Albatross mare, Regina Petit, owned by Lionel Wadiker of Zanesville. Randy Tharps, the trainer driver, her first win of the season. An easy gate to wire score tonight, 157 and uh, two fur. Seventh race, $2 trifecta, $234, $144.80, $144.80. And there were no winners in the twin try carry over for tomorrow evening Saturday night at $2,632, 2632